Going Let's go to the intermission. Servers are here. I'm going to mute and go grab something real quick. Okay. Cat. Cat, cat, get here. Let's listen to some music while we're at it. Uh... Hopefully no ads. Discretion is advised. Unusual. They say oh, why is it all crunchy? What the heck? Strange fascination, infatuation, a lunatic. Oh man, this is like. Call me start what anyway. suits your taste? What is going on? Lotus, did you really just put E back in the chat again? Or no? I can't tell. Cause red means I love you. They say strange fascination, infatuation, a lunatic. Let's bring it up a bit. Tell me what suits your taste. I just want to taste, and I've always heard it's what's inside that counts. Red, and yours are too, and the red on my face Sword is matching you. And goodness, you're bleeding. What a wonderful feeling. You're down and you're bleeding. My head is just reeling. The red means I love you. The taste in your blood means I love you. The red means I love you. They say such a shame I turned out this way A maniac Is this copywritten yet? Well yeah, I get manic when I cause a panic And of course I'm excited when I see you around Cause my insides are red and yours are too And the red on my face is matching you And goodness you're bleeding What a wonderful feeling You're down and you're bleeding My head is just reeling singing getting bored cat please I have work at six got two hours left please turn on the server please turn on the server please turn on the server cat Cat, cat. Can I have it in the persons? Hey, cat. Turn on server, please. Oh. Not much is going on. keep doing laundry let's put on some lo-fi is there any lo-fi I can do what's in my watch later mm. interesting no 
Nope, that's copywritten. Let's try... Where's my lo-fi playlist? Lo-fi witch music. I need to get that out of here, actually. That's not lo-fi, but that's a good song. What can I listen to? I'll listen to Legend of Zelda while we wait. If you want a cheap- And we won't listen to Grammarly ads on YouTube because that's where Grammarly. I get all my music from. Oh, hey, you're here. I'm back. What's up? I did a little bit of singing. Now we're listening to some lo fi. I'm doing laundry. We're still basically Heck just waiting yeah. for Kat to start the server. Let's go into Bunny's server then. Well, her server's not up either. You remember we can use the, the command. Oh, yeah. Okay, you open it up then. Because I don't want to dox it. Just let me know when it's up. I'm done thing. Yeah, you. How you doing? I was singing um, Red Means I Love You. <laughs> mm. That like TikTok song oh, yeah. that's been going on. And I have it stuck <laughs> in my head. And it's like crazy because it like fits my character perfectly now. It's a psychotic maniac <laughs> that likes to stab things. Oh, is that is that your I don't know if it is now or not, but like, could make it that. <laughs> right. Doxing people. We're doxing the server. Good, good. I don't know if that's what it's called. Don't do that. All right. Don't do that. I'm gonna go to. I'm gonna go to Goosey's house. I haven't been on here in forever, so. French fries. Okay. Cause the red on my face is matching you. Goodness, you're bleeding. What a wonderful feeding. You're down and you're bleeding. My head is new. Whose house is this? Who's? Is this the community house? What is this? Where? I'm, I'm like past Goosey's house. Like the thing right in front of Goosey's house. Like to the front and left of it. Oh, I have no clue. I'm way far away. Oh, okay. I'm in a I'm in a snow biome. Oh yeah, that's right, huh? Yeah. Okay, so while while I'm waiting for you to get here, I guess we might as well just start. So I'm curious, oh. what is your 
what is your plan for how you would deal with the snail? Like right. the snail, well, the I mean, snail first is you like should, you're immortal, the snail is immortal prep- until it touches you and you both die. Or you die. I don't know. I guess you could both die. It doesn't really matter. Once you're dead, it doesn't matter. Right, okay, so, um... Hold on, type your chords to me. I am at... I have everything turned off. Okay. Uh, 100... 564. Give me one second. Let me head over there real quick. I'm about a thousand points out. I'll be there soon though. Alrighty. Yeah, yeah. Why don't you go ahead and preface it by explaining what you would Okay, so, oh, and you know what, I should probably, can I, hold on, I'm going to try something. Uh, Let's go to my stream real quick. I want to see if I can do something. My stream online? Yeah, it's on. Yeah, it's You're looking at a jukebox. How do I... I'm live right now. Hold on. <laughs> you will be coming along in your mind. The Immortal Snail Podcast. I'm renaming the stream, basically. Okay. okay. Anyways, so the whole the whole premise from what my understanding is, from what I remember from like the rooster teeth bit that like it was originally from is uh, you get a case with like 40 million dollars um, and you can do whatever you want. And I think you're immortal. I'm pretty sure you're immortal. And yep. there is an immortal snail that like comes with the case, basically. So like if you if you take the deal and like you take the 40 million dollars and become immortal. Um, you also have to deal with this immortal snail and at all moments in time the snail is like sliding at you or like sliding towards you like trying to get you you know um, and if it touches you it you die like that's it like it's lights out you know like just if it touches your skin touches your bare body um, and so it's constantly coming at you at all times and because it's immortal so like it can do whatever it wants you know um, but it's coming at you at the speed of a snail like you know like how what would you do like how would you would you try to fight the snail like would you like shoot the snail off into space or like what, what's your strategy for staying alive and like enjoying life basically i think first off shooting the snail into space is a great idea because let's think of, think about it this way a snail moves at the speed of a snail correct and that, yeah. that, just because just because it's immortal doesn't change that mm-hmm now, if you blast it off into space and get it out into zero gravity, it will never be able to get back down to Earth. Mm. There is, um, like, no circumstance where it will be able to get back down to Earth, especially if it's flung far enough, right? Yeah. So that's something to keep in mind, first off. Something important I would think about. Um, but then you also need to think about you know what like let's say let's say you can't blast a snail off into space because mm-hmm. i mean I- even if i could blast a snail off into space at some point i'm going to want to just be done with my like my mortal existence probably mm-hmm. i honestly for me personally i don't think that i would i would have the capacity to live forever because if i ever fall in love mm-hmm. i'm not aging and she dies and the person I, and she dies that would suck for me yeah. Now, I could, you know, find other love, but, like, that's still gonna suck. So, I honestly think, honestly, I would live, well, I mean, and being immortal means you don't age, so I could, I could potentially live forever, and it would be cool, you know, being able to, mm-hmm. to, you know, experience the world as it grows. Yeah. 
Um, but I'll say honestly, I'm sure there will be a point in time where I'll want the snail to, you know, just do its job and finish it off. Okay. Gotcha. I don't want to live forever. Mm -hmm. But uh, there is another another thing with that, right? Um, I don't have to blast the snail off at all. The snail has to touch my bare skin. Yeah, like so, like if it, if it like if it like gets to you and it like climbs on your shoe, like you're fine. You know, like it's got to like yeah, touch your bare skin, to touch bare skin for like the thing. Right. To work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the snail in a a metal box, mm -hmm. and when I'm ready to go, I'll touch the snail myself. Okay, gotcha. That's pretty much how That's it. Go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I really, it's it's pretty anticlimactic, but I really don't think that it's. Like, it's that big of a, you know, mm -hmm. like, it's pretty simple, so. Gotcha. Okay, cool. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've ever, so, I've, I've got, like, two main scenarios, right? Mm -hmm. And, like, one of them is because, right. like, I'm Christian or whatever, so, like, like, like I, th I think I've said this before on stream, but I'm Christian, and so, like, I believe in heaven and hell and, like, God and all that, and, like, like, being saved by Jesus, died on the cross, all of it, right? And I believe, like, there's an afterlife. So, like... I like let's say in the scenario like that's all still true you know like i'd like the afterlife is still a thing i wouldn't be too like uh upset if like the snail got to me so i wouldn't really care right, right. um but let's say like for certain like for sure in the other scenario we can say like we know that there's no afterlife or whatever right i would definitely want to live forever personally you would? um okay. yeah because because like if there's no afterlife then like what's the like you know death is scary if there's no afterlife like if there's nothing left after that even if it right. means like watching the universe end kind of thing like i think that would be something super cool like i would want to be there at the very end of it all you know that's fair that's fair um hey where even... are you on the server uh i'm like i'm cruising around right now i can go to the spawn um, there's so much so much glass still at the, uh, at the, at the, at the, at the yeah coast. So, like, so, in, like, the first scenario, like, I don't care because, like, I'm going to heaven or whatever because I'm Christian, right? So, like, I don't really care if the snail gets me. Um, it'd be cool to live, like, extra long time, you know? And, like, I'd have, like, $40 million to, like, do whatever I want with. Um, right. So, like, that would be fun. I think I would, I would find ways to invest that to expand my money. Yeah, that, that was, like, the, right. that was the point of, like, the initial plot from what I know is that, like, um, like that you it gives you a head start of like what you want to do because like obviously yeah if you're both immortal like you have like money means nothing to you if you're immortal you know like you right. could you could like invest one penny in, in a million years like you'd be a billionaire but like what's the point of that like you might as well like get started and have fun now you know too right well because so that was also like the, the thing problem. about being patient too because investing takes time you're not gonna have you're not gonna invest a dollar and yeah. get a million back in a month that's not how that works. Yeah, no. It's going to take a lot longer than that. So it's a question as all, as well whether you have the patience for that or not. Yeah. So. Yeah, so for, like, for me personally, um, like, one of the scenarios, like, I came up with was that um, I would start off and I would spend, like, the first, like, billion years with the snail and just like one of those moonshine jars that, like, <laughs> that they, like, make, like, they, they pour moonshine in, right. like, down in the south, oh, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. And I would yeah. just, like, put a cap on it. But the snail is immortal, right? So the snail is going to go around and around and around inside that jar until it wears the glass out, you know? Like, like, like with, like, friction and erosion and stuff like that. It's going to take forever because it's a snail. But it's also it immortal. So it's literally got years. all the time in the universe to do it, right? Right. And I, and I think I think a couple billion years is about the lo as long as it would take for that to happen, you know? Like a snail to go around like and wear through the glass in that one spot. Um, and so what I originally said I was going to do is I was gonna put the snail in the jar and then yeah shoot it into a black hole like like you said earlier right. like into space, but then like you also said like what if I wanted to end it you know, and yeah. one of my friends at work was like, uh, giving me his scenario and he was like oh no I would definitely not want to shoot the snail off into space and I was like why and he's like well what if you want to end it, you know just like you said and he's like if you shoot it into a black hole like you're you're kind of screwed you're gonna live forever you it's know? very true and the, um, the other thing about it too is that, you you right now you say I'd want to live forever you're mm -hmm. gonna get bored extremely bored you're gonna have done everything on planet earth yeah that you can ever do you're gonna have ruled countries and fought wars and you're gonna get bored yeah you know and, and it's like and and right now i think i would want to live forever you know like if there wasn't like an afterlife or anything like that 
Give it a hundred years. Or even have it, you know, like, but like, yeah, but right. like, what if like in a hundred years I change my mind and like the snail's like in a black hole? Like, bro, I'm screwed, right? Like, what am I gonna do? Like, I could shoot myself in that same black hole and hope that I end up right. touching the snail somehow. If it's like, you know, if it hasn't been deatomized, like if I if I touch a snail atom, I guess I can hope, you know, like that's the best scenario. Um, but like other than that, like yeah, like you're in deep trouble. Like if you if you do that, you know. And so the other scenario was put the snail in the jar. And then um, <laughs> for me, I was going to hook it up to a generator and use it as a power source. Because the snail is going to go round and round like a little hamster wheel, you know? And the snail Genius. doesn't have that much mass. So, like, uh-huh. it wouldn't turn very fast. But, like, I'm sure I could hook it up to, like, some gear system or something like that and, like, get it to slowly, right. like, pick up speed, you know? Yeah, man. And, like, 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 I could generate power. And then, like, and then, yeah, if I did ever want to end it all, I'd just take the snail out of the jar. But, like, but, yeah, I would have, like, three mason jars on hand at all times to, to like, do something with that, you know, basically. So, I was like, I don't, know, I don't know what I would do. I really don't. Yeah, it's tough. It really is a tough decision, and it really is down to everyone's own perspective. Yeah. But I'm curious. I, I kind of like your answer, though. That's cool. Because, like, I don't feel like most people would be, like, right off the bat, I feel like a lot of people would be like, oh, yeah, I want to live forever. Or at least live I longer, you know? Like, not. like I, I feel like, right. I feel like, do I do feel like, kind of like you, that, like, being immortal, like, yeah, like, yeah, would probably kind of get old. But, like, I imagine, like, if vampires were real, like, I would love to be a vampire and just, like, watch, like, right. the ages roll by, you know? And, like, be like, oh, yeah, I was there for the Victorian era. Or, some, or something like that, you know? Like, something cool. Definitely. So, well, like, I, I, I will say my perspective is very different just because um, my my perspective on life changed a while back and I'm, I don't want I don't have to get too deep into it yeah, yeah. I don't want to I don't want anyone to you know freak out mm-hmm. or anything but you know my perspective on life changed a lot eh, relatively recently mm-hmm. um, I, I mean it's been it's been um, what a couple weeks since uh, that? Okay. No, so, so uh, I, you know what? I'll just be straight up. I think it's I, you know, I, I, I I'd rather let people know my story. Mm-hmm. Hey, it's um, a podcast. Yeah, so, right. Um, so when I was 18 months old, my mom started seeing signs of mental health issues. Mm-hmm. Uh, in me. And that's really early for showing signs. Yeah, that is really early, actually. I don't know what the what, yeah, are, the, well, what are the signs mom, for that like. Well, it's just like uh, some like over aggressiveness and. Oh yeah. Okay, I got you. You know, and like kids have breakdowns, but like breakdowns basically on steroids. Mm-hmm. Um. But. Uh, she ended up, you know, like she ended up seeing, you know, just you know, kind of seeing the little signs here and there. And then, actually, hold up. You know what? Let me start my stream. We'll make this a story. Just yeah, a yeah. Stream. Here, get inside, though. Like, it's going to be nighttime. You're going to get ganked while oh, you're yeah, yeah, setting yeah. up the stream. <laughs> here, I'll, I'll, I'll do this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Give me one second. Oh, there's a hole in our floor. Uh, but yeah. fix that. Uh, I will say a disclaimer to chat. This gets a little, a little bit triggering for anyone. But I think it's an important topic that we can't just pass around anymore no i like i like deep topics they're like deep talks absolutely i agree even if it's like i don't know i feel like a lot of people like suffer with like depression and so like everybody talks about it and like everybody's tired of talking about it but it's like but it's like a real thing so like might as well talk about it like doesn't get any it doesn't get any less real because it's been a long time exactly exactly or I kind of want to decorate. Also, one follower away from 80 followers, which is nuts. Oh, bro. 
<laughs> we, it's like that's so close. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's would like that's do. just like one of our friends who like we play with who isn't happen like doesn't happen to be like following you for some reason like right like right <laughs> like we could probably put out an at in the Discord and be like hey everybody go follow Evan and you'd probably gain like three followers. Probably. I mean, that's, yeah. That's funny. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's see. Alrighty. Yeah. I'm gonna hop back on the server. Already, uh, but yeah. So uh, you know, as you were saying, Ooh. nighttime. Yeah. <laughs> but um, as you, so as you know, as we were saying, right? Uh, talking about life. Um, you know, as you know, essentially, uh, my mom started seeing signs of like my mental health being not great mm -hmm. when I was really, really young. Um. And I actually went to a psychiatrist and therapist from a young age and um you know just you know it was just like a, it was a lot and i mean it was really overwhelming for me at the time just because um i was a little kid i didn't understand any yeah i don't of think that. i don't think any little like like i did um because i've got like adhd i did therapy for my right. adhd but like mm -hmm. that is not something that you would think like any like kid goes through normally like like any sort no. of therapy as a kid like that's not normal right or i and guess i guess it is because like the average amount of people like probably goes through something mm -hmm. but like you don't think that as a kid right yeah no but it's also like intimidating because you you're a little kid you're going into this doctor's office and basically it feels like you're being interrogated by a person you don't even know about how you're feeling yeah yeah um but you know uh, anyways that was like the start of i guess my mental health journey and it just kind of <laughs> kind of snowballed from there um my my mental health was really bad and even in like even starting in elementary school so i when i went to kindergarten um i kind of i kind of became recognized by other kids as a kid who um who was easily bullied and who was triggered easily as well right so people could say one mean thing and it would piss me off and i would freak out in front of the class of kindergartners yeah and then you know it'd be you know it'd make a, they'd make some jokes and laugh about it because it was entertaining to them because mm -hmm. kids are stupid like and that, that was when young. exactly exactly and you know it went actually i'll be honest with you that whole thing went all the way through elementary school and middle school yeah um and it was rough it was really rough and i'm a little kid who hasn't like at that point i hadn't known much about life um i, my, I had a few friends but like like things were starting to become like real for me yeah and um and then in fourth grade Along with all these kids, you know, constantly bullying, teasing, hazing. Yeah, kids um, being stupid kids, yeah. Right. Um, what you would call it? My my teacher was awful. Like he essentially turned a blind eye, a blind eye to all the harassment, and um, you know, he made my life really hard. And this is in fourth grade. I'm like eight years old. Yeah, the like, life should not that, be hard. For I should not be like... exactly. <laughs> And it's crazy, too, because now looking back on it, like, I should not have been, like, the way that I was, I should not have been. Um, because in fourth grade, I actually attempted to take my own life. Yeah, um, like, that's, like, that's crazy. Like, a fourth grader should never even be, like, at that spot, you know? No, it, no one should, a fourth grader shouldn't even think like, about like, that. Like, nobody that's should have to go through that, let alone a fourth grader. Like, exactly, right? And so it that was really tough. And that was, a, that, 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 those, like, couple years right there were really rough. My grandma died. Mm -hmm. And she was like, my safe place is what I called her. Yeah. Uh, my mom had a miscarriage. Um, yeah, just stuff. It's just really rough. And then, you know, whatever. Just kept moving on with life. Um, just kept seeking therapists. Mm -hmm. And praying and hoping that I would feel better. Um, let's see. In middle school, things kind of got worse. I'll be honest with you. Like... I don't know. It's because I feel like the older you get, the more mean people get, the more that people can like tap into what pisses you off and what ticks you and what makes you angry. Yeah. Um, so, you know, people started you not just calling you names that they could say things like psychologically, they'll just mess you up. Mm -hmm. And that was really tough. Um, so, you know, by, um, you know, I, like by I, my mental health was so bad um and by 
think it was sophomore year of high school, I had attempted to take my own life four times. Yeah. And the reason I'm saying the reason I'm saying this is not to romanticize the the idea of taking your own life or self harm or anything like that. It's mm-hmm. not to brag about my scars or my past pain. It's not at all because I think that that is actually so sick at people who people who talk about that in a way that's almost like appealing or yeah that see that's that's, that's, what, that's what makes that me idea. Really, because like there are people who like yeah like talk mm-hmm. it up like it's something like cool yes or like and or, there like, are TV or that like don't actually do that with as it well. and, like yeah it's just stupid exactly and it's really irritating and then on top of that you know like you know there's just the world is so messed up yeah. so it was really it's really tough and you know i'm um I think my I was I was in therapy essentially uh like most of my life I was in th- I've been in therapy and um luckily pretty recently actually um I've been in a really good place and I've been out of therapy now for like uh how many months I stopped therapy partially I think it's been like been almost six months cool and that's really really crazy because i've never had a break from therapy that long and so you know it was it, it's been kind of weird because i'm so used to you know having a session a week or whatever the yeah, heck. yeah you're used to going somewhere it's weird when your schedule changes like that absolutely but i've realized you know that and i'm i'm my mental health journey journey is nowhere close to over um because I still have struggles daily, but it's interesting because, you know, I look at me in fourth grade as an eight-year-old who hated life so much that he wanted to give up completely. At eight years old, mind you, and looking at back to now, I'm at a place where I'm, you know, I'm beginning to heal. I'm beginning to kind of, you know, start to love myself. I'm beginning to accept myself and accept my flaws and you know (laughs) accept the fact that not everyone's gonna like me and the people who like me are the only ones i should keep around and Mm -hmm. i just i think that that's so important because you know for me it took me 19 years to get there yeah for some people it takes their whole lives and for some people they never get to that healing point because some people some people never get there and like realize those facts exactly exactly and sometimes it's because they just they just aren't there or because they take their own lives mm-hmm. and i'll be honest with you mm-hmm. and i'll be honest with you as much as people say it and it sounds cliche and people who are dealing with mental health disagree sometimes death is not the answer no. i if i had if i had taken my life back in fourth grade i would not be where i am now i would not you know have friends that I enjoy hanging out with so much, you know, looking back on it, if I had told my fourth grade self where I'd be right now, they wouldn't believe me. They'd be like, what? Um, you know. <laughs> well, yeah, it's crazy. You're actually too. doing you know, slightly better? Little like, <laughs> I'm yeah. doing better? Yeah, but it's like, you know, it's crazy. Like, you know, like looking back, I was miserable and now I tolerate myself every morning and I have the energy to get up and go to work every day. Yeah. And, I, I, I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine that. And I mean, I, I was t- eight, so I wasn't going to work anyway. But, yeah. <laughs> you know, like, like I've, you weren't I've doing had much. so many. But yeah. Right, right. But I've had so many other successes from, you know, that actually came from me staying alive. And if I had taken my own life, I wouldn't be an affiliate on Twitch, which sounds silly, but that's a huge success to me. If I had taken my own life i wouldn't be here talking with you and i think that that's super important because you're a great guy and one of my good friends and mm-hmm. you know it's you know i don't i can't even can't even begin to express how grateful i am every day of life that i have yeah so it takes time to get there it takes time to get to a point where you love yourself and you forgive yourself for your mistakes and you accept other people's forgiveness and other people's compliments and you know my only advice to those people would be every second of every single day, you know, even if you don't have the strength to forgive yourself for all your mistakes or to accept that compliment from that person, take a step towards that. Take a step towards loving yourself. You know, like that, 
that's the main thing or at least me. take a step towards exactly. not hating yourself exactly even just not hit exactly so you get it because like like it doesn't it doesn't have to be like like yeah you're not going to be like with the snap of your fingers like all right in a second like i don't like no, i don't suffer no, from that at no. all but i know like that's not how emotions work like as no, a scientist like not. the chemical imbalances that cause depression like it's not something where you just like take some meds and like it's instantly fixed it's something no, that like, and meds don't even work for yeah and sometimes, mo so, most meds know. it's it's super weird because like some meds like totally work like after like a couple mm -hmm. like dosages like three days like you start feeling better instantly because i've got a couple friends who struggle right. with it and they like they actually have good meds that work but that like sometimes your body's like grows tolerances to it or um like you yeah, just like things just... just get worse or like what or like sometimes like the meds are like reverse like the reverse effects happen and like you feel even worse and so it's like mm -hmm. like meds like it's not there's not there's no magical genie in a bottle who just like fixes everything like that's not no. a thing like it's something that does the only of time and that's what I feel like a lot of people who do suffer with depression don't often realize. And, like, that is often one of the main reasons that they end up killing themselves is because, like, they don't realize, oh, like, it's not going to, like, get fixed instantly. It's not going to be a fast process. And so they give up, like, too early, you know, almost. Because, like, yeah, right, sometimes yeah. it can take, like, too long. Um, well, and, and that's, the that's why one of the main re patient, that's why, like, yeah. one of the main things you said is, like, yeah, like, take your time. Like go through it you know mm -hmm. like work it exactly. out exactly because like yeah it's and not it's instant. crazy too yeah and i mean it's crazy too because as a kid i didn't have the patience oh yeah I, I didn't if i if i was not scared of how badly it would have hurt and how badly i knew trying to take my own life hurt i would have yeah at that time but i i'm so glad that i didn't and it's tough because kids and teenagers they don't have patience to wait for life to get better and you Most don't, kids don't have I mean, patience it's... for anything, let alone that. Right. And, you know, it's not even just waiting. And it's, you know, when you already have no motivation to, you know, even get out of bed, how are you going to have motivation to, you know, get up and go to therapy or get up and give do self do something to give yourself some self-care or love? Yeah. Like, it's, you know, there's there's so many reasons. And then, you know, I hear adults or other people, in like, not validating those people for their struggles just because... You know they don't fully understand what's going on yeah. and or they've never really dealt with those situations you know you just have to you just have to always keep in mind that even if you've had experiences with mental health and even if you know you're doing great and you're in a place of healing and then hope and love not everyone's situations will ever be the same and you need to always remember that yeah if that person that you know said they were struggling with things for years is looking better if they can do it you can too and even if you don't believe it then that doesn't make it real that doesn't make prove it, it real exactly then Just prove me wrong like, yeah you know prove like, me wrong yeah. don't don't take your life don't don't you know don't take your life but you know like prove me wrong if you think that you like i, I i've tell i told my friend this too and you know she's in a she's in a different place now, which is good. But um, I, I remember telling her, um, she was like, you know, you look like you're doing better. Like this guy looks like he's doing a lot better. And and I don't I can never do that. Like there's no way. Mm -hmm. And honestly, to her and to everyone else who tell, says that, I would say, prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. Don't take your life. Don't hurt yourself. Instead, instead. Put in the effort, and if you and if you put in the effort and things are still not working after, you know, after a long, long time because it takes it took wow. me 18 years, so you know, give or take like 20 years. Come back to me in 20 years and we'll talk again. But and if you're also, not trying, it's also then... hilarious that like hilarious like haha you're stupid, but like right. Um, people think that that way about a lot of things. Yeah, like, people think that way about like investing money. Or like mm -hmm. uh, pursuing a career that they want to do, or like right. becoming like uh, a famous YouTuber, like like people yeah. all the time are just like, oh yeah, there's no way, like that that's like that's not real, like I can't do that, like you know, like right. they just don't well, believe. And like mm -hmm. when it comes to something like depression, like that is the most crucial thing that you say, no, I'm gonna try it anyways. Like that is the most yeah. crucial time you could ever shut up about the exactly. idea that it doesn't work or like that it's fake, you know, mm -hmm. or like that it won't yeah. be, it won't be you, like I won't be the guy who makes right. it, you know right and i also you know i i also believe in god um yeah. and so i i honestly think that you know i'm not trying to preach to anybody or 
be you know pre you know breach anything to anyone but i i honestly think that god has his timing and as much as we want things to happen here and now when we want this to happen this way or that way um if we're not you know god has his timing and if you and if you're so focused on what you want in that moment or that your internal clock then you're not going to see the big scheme of things the the grand plan and design that's been put into place and that's and, not and that's not to say necessarily that you'll ever see it you might exactly. you might not ever see it but it's still there right and and it's interesting too if you look at your daily day-to-day -day life like uh, the other day um I was getting, I had to go to work. Mm -hmm. I was going to miss the train. And I run there, and I'm getting my ticket. Yeah. And the train's pulling up, and I'm like, I know I'm going to miss this train. Yeah. Well, then a lady in a wheelchair pulls up, and they have to load, pull down yeah, the Yeah, they have to stop everything, let her to like, on. you know, give them a minute mm -hmm. to like, get everything on. Exactly. So that gave me time to get on. And in the moment, you know, in the moment, I was like, oh, that's great. Good, I can move on now. But even little things like a stoplight turning green at the right time or, you know, finding a dollar in your back jeans pocket, you know, those things. happen for a reason because you, you might not even recognize it. You know, you might not recognize, oh, ah, I'm going to, I'm you know, I'm going to be five minutes late to work because of these red lights. But then you'll realize if you weren't, if you, if, the, if it weren't for those red lights, you would have been in a car crash, you know, yeah, little dude, things like the, that to show you. All the things add up. Like, it's like exactly. it's all one big butterfly effect basically yeah which is like but hilariously again, like the scientific term for it but like that's literally all right. god's plan is it's like oh yep every little atom falls into its domino place and things happen mm -hmm. and like and that's that's the thing about it too is the, the specificity yeah. god has everything done for a reason and he makes sure that every part is put into place right when it needs to be it's the perfect the perfect the perfect chaos i would say yeah. in the way that we see it but to him you know we're looking at it from a perspective where it all seems like a bunch of jumbled up shapes and squares and rect rectangles and he actually sees you know the whole map the whole grand design of everything else yeah so the, you know we just have the whole to watch ticking mm -hmm. exactly we just see the one moment there we're so just, we're just I, looking I, at yeah. years <laughs> exactly so yeah, I just I think that's interesting to you know think about. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, let's move on to another topic because I'm a I'm a podcast man. So. All right. Well, here's here's the next topic. I'm kicking you out of yeah, the fire yeah. tree. <laughs> or not like kicking you out, uh, but like I'm making the fire no. tree a fire tree. <laughs> yeah, yeah. As you should, King. As you should. Uh, no, it's gonna look sick though, dude. What the heck? Yo, this is gonna look so sick. So I decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to make, like, I'm going to make part of it, like, um, I'm going to put, mm -hmm. like, little magma blocks everywhere. So, like... That's sick. Like, you should do, like, a trunk out of red glass and then lava inside of it so you can well, so, see yeah, the lava so, like, I was going to make it so, like, not all the leaves were hot, but, like, some of the leaves are going to be magma blocks, so, like, they glow. Oh, yeah. You know, just, like, every, nice. every one of the once in a while, kind of, like, kind of, like, almost how, like, during mm -hmm. fall, like, the leaves turn red. Right. Like, some of the cobblestone should... is just going to be magma block. You should add some texture of having some obby, like, like probably... it mixed in with the blackstone. I might well. do that too. I'm not Good sure. Mm -hmm. I have to build my house on this server. Still, I haven't done that. I mean, I have like a house way out in the tundra, but I want one over here. Oh, you do have a house in the tundra, like out in the snow. I do I already built it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, that's cool. Just because of the witchcraft, I was like, yeah, I'll have it to honor my my old house. Yeah. Um, but yeah. Let's, let's see. What should I do? Oh, I don't know. For my... What are you trying to at? think? I don't know. <laughs> Not building. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me either, I mean, right? I built... I built... I built uh, the big pirate ship boat. But then I blew it up. But that looked pretty good. Um, I don't know, dude. You can do a lot of things. Uh... Hmm. Do you want to just do, like... Are you just gonna go in that flat area, like right there? Yeah, that's where I am. You should just build like um. Oh, you know what? Hold on, let me see if I can pull up my Instagram. I saw something a while back that I really wanted to build. You might like it. <laughs> yeah, that profit plug guy saw my message forty-seven minutes ago. No response. <laughs> <laughs> Loser. 
<laughs> trying to fake it, dude. I hate those people who like. Oh man, try to bounce off you other people's that plot you like can that. See when people see it. Yeah. Uh, let's see. All my saved posts. I might be scrolling through a couple. Okay, so there was this one, um, and it's like sort of like a medieval house, and I like it because of that first foundation. Like those stairs look pretty cool. Um, but there was another thing I was gonna want. Oh, there's a witch tower that I really would like. But also, if you're just looking for like a cool like cottage abode, this third one is like the mm -hmm. best one. I feel like. Oh, that's sick. Like it's medieval. Oh, these are all like, cool. I don't know. Like, like the I, house. I really like that first the that last one I just sent you. Like the stairs and like I love like the little round like birch and like all of it. It looks really cool. Ooh, and then I've got and then I've got some stuff for decorations. I've got some statues. I might. You should you somewhere. should send me some more. You should send me some more suggestions. Yeah, okay. dude. Send me every single suggestion you got. Let's I'm see. gonna throw them. The witch's hut looks so cool. Oh, here's a good one. Here's like this one kind of reminds me of like um. A medieval like saloon or like a bar you know oh okay what if i made like a small little medieval town hey kind of go for it thing. i mean i don't know I don't who know. would live in it and stuff <laughs> i don't think anyone would oh and here's a cool pattern for uh, a floor oh 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 that looks sick oh that's awesome you can just do that with like any type of stairs it doesn't have to be cobble obviously hold on i have i've saved some on my instagram as well Wait, what am I doing? Let me just... Hold on. Let me look up the guy who I follow. Blocky. I follow some people. I've saved... I follow a guy called I Blocky Creations. Let me send you one of his things. Yeah, he yeah, does, yeah. like, high-end, like, really cool stuff. Send him on my way. So, look. Th just, like, look. click on that most recent post that I sent you, and it'll, it'll take you to his thing. He does... Like, Whoa. I get a lot of my build ideas from him. And, he, and it's really cool, because he does, like, ones that are, like, super easy to build, and then he does the ones that are, like, high quality, but, like, they all still right. look good. So, like if, right. like, if you're, like, a hardcore builder and, like, you're willing to spend, like, 30 hours on a build, like, mm -hmm. his hardest build would be good for you, or his, like, most complex right. build. But, like, so, like, he'll make a tree where it's, like, one of those giant oak trees like I'm trying to do, or he'll make a tree where it's, like, five little sticks, and, like, it still looks good. And there's just, like, so many Fair. ideas. I get almost all of my ideas from him. These are so cool. I'm looking through all my stuff. Let's see. I can make a motorcycle. <laughs> yeah, you could. Yo. No, like, there's the... the... Uh, Let's see, where's the rest of the cobble? Yo, are we finally out of cobble? That's actually kind of cool. Let me grab the stairs. Let me grab the cobble slab. Yo, that PC setup looks sick. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? He's, he's got no, pretty good stuff. There's a Minecraft PC setup. Like, in Minecraft. Oh, you mean, oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I thought you meant his PC setup. No, he's got a sweet PC setup. I'm ready for the, the bundles, because there's already a dupe glitch that I'm thinking about trying. Oh, really? Yo, there's an Ender Dragon hide carpet. If we could go to the end, I could get a yeah, dragon. Yeah, dude, like, he, like I said, like, he does a ton of cool stuff. Like, dope yeah. stuff. Gosh, I'm trying to decide which one I want to do. Uh, yo, Timber's pulling that clutch. But it is in the Asgoda with the coal, baby. Anyways. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna do a futuristic looking house. Cool. Sleepy time. Are we sleeping? What are we doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Come on down. Come on down to the Olive Garden and get yourself breadsticks. Breadsticks. Sleepy time. Sleepy time. Already 
let's pull some forts. Sorry, chat, I can't see you, but you say anything I apologize. Oh, hey, I got a phone call a second ago. Oh, from Grandma. Hold on, let me, uh, let me mute up real quick. Or, at least on the stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yo, Grandma. Cool, cool. My grandmother uh, pays for our uh, our AAA like towing, you know, like the tow truck company or whatever. Because like we we do our insurance through AAA, so we get a discount on their towing distance as well. Right. So if we get like their platinum card or whatever, we get like a hundred miles, and it's like super cheap. So my grandmother, um, like for Christmas, like always pays for it. Um, but recently, like her credit card changed or whatever, and so I got a thing in the mail, and it was like, "Oh, you're not gonna get it anymore." And I was like, "Oh, well, Grandpa's gonna need to get her car towed if like anything happens, so I better let Grandma know." So Sorry. I was letting her know. That's good. Good grandson right there. Yeah. Ugh. Minecraft, why you do me like this? Hey, yo, yo, yo. Let's see. Oof. I'll just do a thing. Do I like the thing? I'm not sure yet. Dude, MJ's in the third BC. <laughs> uh, seven, eight. Well, she's on a different server right now. Yeah, so. And Goosey messaged. I wonder what's up with Cat. I wonder if she's alright. Okay. Ooh, yeah, that does not look good. That's yucky. What happened? I'm trying to. <laughs> I made my tree a little square. <laughs> it's a little uh, more square than I'd like. <laughs> Square tree. I'm going for the more organic shape. And like... 
you know, just straight up didn't happen. Right. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. How does that work? Oh, just. Red stone still comes. Oh, sentry. Yo, it's MJ in my chat. Whoa. MJ in the chat. What? No way. Mm -hmm. Yo, MJ, oh, also are MJ. She still gifted my. She gifted me like two subs and subbed and cheered twenty bits, and I cried. Yo, that's awesome. Yeah, it was really sweet of her. Okay, so she's we probably you, following MJ. her. If she subbed. Uh, yeah, she just. I mean, that's usually how that works. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, we have a lot of creeper holes. Dude, for real. I feel like Goosey got mad at one point. She was like, I don't want to keep cleaning the server room. Oh, wait, it might have been Bunny. Somebody was freaking out about it because it is obnoxious. Yeah. That's why in a lot of servers the rule is clean up your damn creeper holes. Well, and I know some servers, like the server I used to play on with my friends at church, um, you, they used to have like anti-griefing software that like reversed explosions. So like creepers would blow up and like the hole would be there and then like a minute later like the hole would fill itself back in. Which yeah, was kind of cool, could, except then you couldn't, also... use, you couldn't use regular TNT then, which like kind of stunk. Right. Uh, there is an option in servers now that creepers can may like do damage but they the explosions don't actually affect land or builds oh that's cool which i think is way better so dude i'm liking the tree the tree's looking good the tree's looking spicy Although man I feel like i feel like the magma block should actually go should i do floor to ceiling windows is that a good idea or is that too cliche what like what windows Floor to ceiling. Oh, maybe. Like, maybe like one or two. Right. Like, just on the front or something like that. Absolutely. Okay, I'll put the diorite in there, because diorite's ugly, and I'll remember to take it back out. Oh, and I need some of this dirt and stuff for blocks. Oh, there's more diorite. <laughs> Oh my goodness. What's up? You will not believe. You will not believe. I will not believe. Mm -mm. Um. What's we call it? Um. Did you?
you know MJ's like actually crazy famous on TikTok? <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. Yeah, that's she, cool. she has like 53k followers on TikTok. Yo, is, that's cool. Oh, you know, wait, does she, is her like, TikTok like just full of her art? Yeah. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> she's cracked at it, dude. Though. Her she's, art is so good. I, I don't blame her, any of her TikTok followers. Like, she's got amazing art. Yeah. Absolutely cracked. I wonder if she has like an Instagram because I don't. I don't have a TikTok. Like, I don't go on TikTok. But I would definitely follow her on Instagram if I had it. If like I found it. Speaking of which, I'm gonna need to get a new pickaxe. I don't know why it was speaking of which. I just came to my mind. Dude, that's hilarious. Pretty I'm surprised. Crazy. Oh, you know what? She doesn't stream though, does she? Uh, I think she does stream. Does she? Okay. Cause I remember somebody on here like doesn't stream because like they don't have equipment and stuff. And I couldn't remember I if think it was that's her or not. Vision. That might be that's vision, true. yeah. You know what? That might be probably yeah. vision. Cause I was about to say, like, dang, like if she's like that popular on TikTok, she might as well stream on Twitch, cause like she would she would blow up. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. absolutely. Easy. Dude, imagine if she blew up like Ranbu. Like she gets popular oh, off of TikTok and then like crazy. blows up like on the stream. Right. That'd be well, so I mean, cool for her. Yeah, that would be sick. That would be awesome. We would be so happy. Okay. I think I know. Oh wait, I came down here for. Yeah, iron. Cool. Got stuck to my things. Yeah, dude, I was actually gonna, um, I was gonna see if I could give her, like, a commission for that, uh, piece that she made for me, like, my logo, basically, that I'm using in Discord, my new, my new logo, because... Careful now, she can hear you. Dude, it's, well, no, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna offer anyways. It's sick. But yeah, it's right. sick, dude, and I was like, I don't know if she'd be down to do more, but I would love more, because it's so freaking cool. Heck yeah. MJ, if you're hearing this, you're really talented. Yeah. <laughs> oh, zombie. Get me over, zombie. Now your blood's on my side. Eat it in the fetus, zombie. Everybody dance now. Yo, the fire tree's starting to look good. It's starting to look real. This tree is on fire. Fire, fire. Ooh. This tree. Ooh, I need more magma fire. blocks. This is gonna look good. Ooh. Oh, spider. I'm gonna stop singing before I get demonetized. <laughs> before you get demonetized? <laughs> Why? I can make money on Twitch. I don't want to get a strike. No, but you're not going to get a strike for singing. The song? Yeah, I could. No, no. It has to be the actual uh, audio clip from the song. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, you can sing as much as you want, as long as it's independent. Like, it's you singing, and it's not the, the original <laughs> right, right, right. song. That's why I was like, yeah. uh-oh, copyrighted music, because I was playing it. But you can sing it as much as you want. Oh, fire. Yeah. That's awesome. Good to know. Uh Otherwise, we'd all be getting copyright strikes for happy birthday. <laughs> yeah, oh, you're right, because happy birthday is copyrighted. That's dumb, by yeah. the way. That, that's dumb. Whoever copyrighted happy birthday is a monster. I mean, kudos to the guy who wrote it. Imagine writing, like, a song so much that, like, it's so good that it, like, blows up and, like, yeah, people use it for generations and generations. And then one day you're like, hey, I, I want to make, like, some money off of this and copyright it. It's just monetize yourself. <laughs> okay. I'm stealing the magma blocks from the ruined portal. Iron bars actually have a pretty cool aesthetic. They do. I, l I love iron bars. Hold on. Yikes. Let's do the birch. 
was almost bad, but it wasn't. Because I'm good at what I do. Alright. Things are real. Uh, Cause my insides are red and yours are too. And the red on my face is matching you. And when you're bleeding, what a wonderful feeling. You're down and you're pleading. Oh, my head is reeling. For red means I love you. I can't parkour. Why can't I parkour? Sorry, piggy. I slapped the piggy. You know what? Piggy. <gasps> Why would you slap the piggy? You. Sorry, I had to drink that too. <laughs> Man, Minecraft building, am I right? Yup. Ooh, I should probably charge my phone. I got work in like an hour. Oh, yeah, you do. Imagine oh, no. working evenings. <laughs> I know, right? Leb. ceiling windows right here. Ooh, it's looking good. <laughs> Dude, I'm loving Last fire break. tree. Fire go. tree looking good. Fire tree looking hot. Ooh, fire tree. Boom, chakalaka. More like burn chakalaka. <laughs> Bad joke. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. Hey, back off! I'm not a big zombie fan. What you want? What you want? What you know about rolling down in the deep? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. What do you know? Mm -hmm. What doth know about rolling down in dank deep? <laughs> what dank deep? What does? What dost thou know about rolling down in thine deep? When thine head grows... I don't remember all the words. I'm gonna be up in the club, <laughs> Shakespearean style. <laughs> yeah. Doing whatever what I like. What dost thou know? I'm gonna be popping that bubbly. My booty looking so lovely. Anyways, um... <laughs> Oh, cool, the server saved the game. Yo. Back off, man. Yo, it's a baby zombie. Yo, those are worse. killing the Killing the guy. Hey. Alright. Bye, baby zombie. Bye. Ooh, I need, uh -huh. I need to do one more little thing for Fire Tree. One more oh, block you zombie. don't have anything good, sir. I'm gonna put a block right there. Blah! Blah! Yeah, they are dead. Okay. Choo, 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 choo. Yo, timbers are kicking butt! Set oh, really? by! Gotta go! Yeah, 3 to 0, man. Wow. Against Austin, Texas. Dang, okay. Hey, that's nothing crazy, though. Oh, really? Texas has three soccer teams in the MLS, they're all at the very bottom of the standings. Oof. Yeah. Rip. Guess not everything is bigger in Texas. Hey, oh. <laughs> Got him. Fire tree is almost done. I can't do floor to ceiling windows. I need to have some secret spots. What? You didn't hear that? <laughs> Secret spots are the best, especially like when they're redstone secret spots. 
Ooh, yeah, dude, I agree. Redstone is fun. That's one of them is going to be. I think all of them are going to be redstone. Cool, cool. The thing I love about redstone is you like redstone can be super inconspicuous. Like, oh yeah, just like a button on some like, dirt, and then like the when you press the button, it like breaks itself, but the door also opens. Right, or like um, or even just something that doesn't look like it seems like you hoe a piece of dirt. Like you, you oh yeah, know, and that's, you that opens hoe it. Hoe a piece of dirt, and that opens it. There's crazy things you can do like that, and I found a couple that I'm gonna use. They are tight. Super cool looking. I want this to look like the mansion that I will never have. Like the, it's like Robert Downey Jr. Iron Man mansion. Like just. No, you might nutty. get there someday. Hopefully. Thanks for the hype, bro. Yeah. Um, I need to do that here. Let's get rid of that. That's an ugly spot for a block. You're an ugly spot for a block. Honestly, probably. I yeah, don't want to put a block on me. I wouldn't be weird. It would uh, it would stray away from my voluptuous butt. <laughs> voluptuous, dude. That. that is like a vocab word. <laughs> yeah, it's voluptuous. Vocab word of the day. Voluptuous. <laughs> voluptuous. Doth thou know? Thine voluptuous rump. <laughs> voluptuous rump. Oh, Thy voluptuous <sighs> piece of booty. <laughs> Thine, thine wishes to violent. partake in thine voluptuous rump. <laughs> thine, thine voluptuous. Oh, I, I am here with a message from the king. He would like to partake in your voluptuous booty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Bro. Voluptuous. That is a new one. Voluptuous. Okay, fire tree is done. Yay, good job, fire tree. Let's go. Everyone put fire tree pog in the chat. Everybody put voluptuous fire tree in the chat. Voluptuous fire. <laughs> <laughs> voluptuous. My favorite word. Hey, curious. Now that witchcraft is go over, are we allowed to use like the like I wasn't allowed to use flint and steel. Yeah, am you I are. Allowed, yeah. Am I allowed to use flint and steel? It's now it's just the bunny SMP until we do the witchcraft. Okay, so that means that's good because I don't want to waste like fifty. <laughs> You're tired of I'm using tired those of fire charges. Yeah, dude, they kind of they kind of do you dirty. I gotta go get blaze every single time I use one. That's obnoxious. It's pretty expensive. Now every time someone says voluptuous, I'm gonna not I'm not gonna be able to help but crack up and laugh. Every time somebody says voluptuous, which isn't very often, but when it does happen, no. I'm gonna think of you. I'm going <laughs> like... to think of me and laugh. <laughs> You no, know, that's the, the crazy thing too is you know how like little kids when you say like butt or poop or something they'll laugh. Oh yeah. That's me with the word voluptuous. Yeah, it is it is you with the word <gasps> voluptuous, man, honestly. Welcome to my stream. I dub be voluptuous. Double cheeked up on a Thursday afternoon. Hella ass. Pimped up on a Wednesday morning. <laughs> We're in black because I'm in mourning. Be... I'm depressed. <laughs> AF. I thought you were just going to say I'm depressed. <laughs> just like that's how the song goes. <laughs> I am depressed. <laughs> Pimped out on a Wednesday morning. We're in black because I am in mourning. I'm depressed. Life got me feeling stressed. Yo, fire tree looks But cool. I love it. My voluptuous butt is lovely. Crafting it up with the boys. I know we're adults, but we play with toys. Nerf guns for clarification because I'm not into Whoop. 
not gonna say that word on stream, but you catch my drift. You know. I'm gonna make that a song. This is so funny. What are you up to? Uh, I don't know. Not much. Punching some dirt. Punching some dirt. Punching some dirt. I have something better than punching some dirt. Yeah, what? Well. Okay, we're gonna play a game. Oh, okay. I want you to stand on this piece of bedrock right here. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Stand. No, actually, we'll make it like a hole because it's. It's, a, it's gonna be a game. Don't worry, don't oh, worry. Okay. 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 In the hole. Mm, in the hole, yes. Yep, in the hole. And then... Mm, fun game. GG's. Mm, just, <laughs> GG's. wow. <laughs> Do you like your new living space? <laughs> this, <laughs> this is the box. MTV Cribs, welcome to the box. MTV Cribs, welcome to the box. Okay, let, wait, wait, wait. Let me let me take off my hood inside. Uh, you know, it's it's, it's, it's not uh, <laughs> take off your. It's it's not uh it's not as uh, cold in here as it is outside, but you know, it's it's nice. You can't take off your blindfold though. No, nah, no, nah, I can't. Secret identities. You there. should make your you should make your blindfold 3D though. That would look sick. So I thought about screen. doing that, but then like put it on both. I like, could, do, like, but if I do blindfold. 3D, um, then it like then I can't take the hood off. Or like the hood. Oh, wait, turn there. around for me. Turn around for me. Yeah, you can. Absolutely. Oh, that's cool how it crosses over. Yeah. It it it's like tied okay. and stuff. You can go. You, you can go oh, back to your regular life. No. <laughs> <laughs> my my living room. <laughs> my living my living room. Oh man. Work for me, redheaded slave. I I enslave people. Only redheads though. Dude, it's hilarious. So like, not not I'm not I'm not be uh, racist or anything like that. But like, for some reason, I feel like when people complain about racism and like slavery and stuff, or like they try to like use slavery as like, oh wow, your people messed up in America. It's like, you realize slavery has been around like way longer than America has, and there's actually more slavery today than there was back like before the civil rights era in America. Bro, like, there's and more all the of it. child, dude, then child traffickers too, man. Child, Bro, well, the world is a not scary even, not place, even dude. that, but like, in Africa, like, there's a huge market, even even still for like for their own people, like, for slavery. Yo, that's messed and up, it's, bro. It's so messed up. Yo. Um, and before that, uh, the Irish got enslaved too, like even like during uh the civil rights like era and stuff like that for America, like the Irish were uh, enslaved as well as blacks. They, but like it was easier to find blacks in Africa and like shipping over because like the Irish were a little more um, not civilized. Yo man, like... take your dirt. Take your dirt. Oh yeah, here. They weren't yeah, more civilized, but they were more developed. So like they had better weapons and stuff like that. Um, but like the Irish people were enslaved. And dude, back in ancient times, the Romans just enslaved whoever the heck they wanted. They were like, oh, black, white, Asian, Roman, <laughs> you're slave. Like they did not, care. they did <laughs> Roman? not discriminate. <laughs> They did not discriminate what at all. Like so, like, like it, oh, it, you're a demigod. Yeah, like, it <laughs> does not. It did not matter to them. Jeez. But yeah, like it's crazy. And so, like that, that like kind of makes me mad when people are like, oh, reparations for black people because they were the slaves. And I was like, dude, so many people were slaves. <laughs> like you don't understand. That's true. That's true. I mean, they're still allowed to be mad. Yeah, they're. they're, they're, they're I'm not saying like they shouldn't be mad. I mean, about it. yeah. And it's but, literally like, not even my place to say I'm not African American. Yeah. But it, but it's but it's funny or, or like literally anybody who's like black people were the only slaves ever. And I was like, you like never read a history book or like never even like you didn't even look that up on Wikipedia before you said that. Like, <laughs> there are a lot of a, a lot of uneducated people on the internet. I will say. Yeah. Even I say uneducated things on the internet, but usually it's something dumb about Minecraft that I think is funny. And I'm supposed to be sounding uneducated because that's yeah, usually part of it's my not. Character. You are like trying to pick a fight with somebody about like a, a really hardcore topic. Like, <laughs> absolutely not. No, I'd rather stay out of that on social media, man. Yeah. Not my place. I want a happy, positive vibe. I don't want to hear about who you voted for in the presidential election. Just yeah. not, at least not on my streams and in my and in my socials. That's yeah, not. Honestly. That's not. not yeah, for this, me. this is like Minecraft. Like that's not what we're here for. And. It doesn't matter, like, people freak out all the time, and I remember, like, back when the elections or whatever, people were, like, coming into chat being like, who'd you vote for? Because I'm 18, so I can vote. Oh my gosh, that is and, so annoying. And I was like, 
Yo, I can imagine getting into that, like if you, chat. if like your entire thing was talking about that, or like if that oh, was like yeah. your personal account. But like, I'm not gonna like be streaming Minecraft and then be like, who did you vote for? No, absolutely not. And that the other thing too is like, that's just, like first so... off, that's a that's a breach of personal information. Yeah. And also, if you you like, no matter what I say, I will get canceled by some group of people. Yeah, Let's you, be honest. You'll you'll you'll, you'll be grumpy about somebody like i'll tell you like what my values are on like certain topics and stuff but right. like but anybody who just comes in and like on an unrelated note it's just like who did you vote for it's like dude you like there's no good answer to that like you are asking or for even trouble. just politics in general man i don't i just i keep it out of my freaking discord keep it out of my twitch keep it off my socials i don't care about your political views if you want to talk we can shoot me a dm but i'm not gonna talk to him in front of everybody and I refuse to. Yeah. It's yeah. Just... It's kind of like but it's yeah, kind of like asking like it's kind of like when your girlfriend asks you like if your if her butt looks big. There's no good answer to that question. There's, it's such a loaded question. Like you know like there's there's no way you can answer that question and not get in trouble. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Or if she asks you if you think another girl is cute. Yeah. If you say yes, then she's gonna be like, "Oh my gosh, are you cheating on me?" But if you say no, she's be like, "Oh my gosh, do you hate women?" <laughs> it's kind or of like, funny. Or or she'd be like, "Why are you looking at her?" And you're like, "Well, because you asked me." And she's like, "But you weren't supposed to look at her." Like you know, like you just what supposed kind to of know. test is that? Dude. I'm a dumb I'm a dumb male. Don't expect that much from me. Seriously. <laughs> it's kind of funny. No, I. I would be like, no, she's pretty, but never as pretty as you. Yeah. Straight facts, baby. Straight facts. And I'm, yeah, man, I'm still bummed about this other chick. I told you about that whole thing, right? No, what? There's yeah, a I, I didn't tell you. No. Oh, I'm there not, was. I <laughs> For know like that. a week. Yeah, dude. What? We'll talk about it off stream because I think she knows that I can stream on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it was. It was really. It was going great. <sighs> Until it wasn't. <laughs> yeah, it was great. I'm not mad. I understand her reasoning for it, but I'm just still bummed because gotcha. we we were really compatible. Hey, are you gonna put um these on, just like the smooth uh, are you gonna put that here too? Um, I think I'm gonna no. I'm gonna leave these different just because I want to have a some texture. So what? Um, so why don't you, why aren't you getting rid of these then? Oh no no yeah these are gonna stay the same yeah okay, no, these, okay. I'm just I'm just running so you're not I'm gonna, gonna run the this whole end of the wall. window oh I'm gonna do it I'm just, oh you I mean, are I'm just oh 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 yeah okay through. yeah gotcha gotcha yeah. Dude, look at fire tree fire tree I'm so happy oh fire there's tree. just a little bit on fire there's just a tiny bit I ran out of netherite <laughs> or uh nether whatever it is netherrack netherrack here I got you yeah actually no, you like these two things legit so I'll leave it up. Yeah, no worries. I, I mean, now that we're done, I guess I don't have to, but like, right. I don't know. You've committed yourself so much to the good work. I'll uh, I'll lay some the real down the real point of the server you. was the just like the October fun. You know, for the month and like do the challenges. Right. I think it's gonna become more of an event server. I know that Apple is planning like a, a laser bow tag game that's gonna be fun it's like laser tag but with bows mm -hmm. which is gonna be sick yeah i do um, feel like it's gonna become an event server yeah oh definitely but i'm excited it's been, it's been sick do we want some blue fire dude dude get rid of all of it and make it all blue fire you want it to do blue fire okay. yeah dude blue fire would be oh, dope soul, soul No, soul sand falls. No, it doesn't. Dude, blue fire would be awesome for that. And if you want to, if you want to remove that very, very top center layer of cobble and make that all soul sand, and then light all of that so it's just like all on fire, that would be cool. I yeah, I got you. That. Just that very top layer though. <laughs> that way, it's like the tree's got hair. The tree has a wig on. How's your lace front going? How's your lace front? My lace front? It's basically it's just a wig. Oh. Nah, my hair is good. 
I was asking the tree, but anyway. I'm just oh, <laughs> I was super confused. I was like, what about my hairline? Like, what? Like, no, my hair's fine. <laughs> like, use you more? <laughs> I mean, like, I appreciate hey, no, the worry, but. You said that out of defense, so I'm just suggesting, like, maybe your hairline isn't as good as you think. <laughs> <laughs> Here, let's do it. What if you did, like, an intermix of red and. Yeah, sure. Red. Here, wait, let me, let me see the blue like just that. by itself. Let me come up in a minute. I'm okay. cooking food. I'm still cooking food on the campfire because it's. I feel fishing. like it's, it looks cool, but I feel like I need to add some some red in, mm. kind of even me, it out a little bit. Let me look. Ooh. People, things going on. Oh, hey, free, free boots. Cool. Oh, see, I like the blue. I feel like it's too much by itself. I feel like it needs some orange. Put some orange on there, then. Okay. Let me see what it's like. Oh, I just... Oh, man, I just blew up something else. Whoops. It's okay, I'll fill it in. Oh, yeah, okay. Let me go over to my first house that I ever stayed in. Somebody blocked it up? Oh, because there was a villager in here at one point. Is he still in here? No, he's gone. <laughs> he did. He very much not alive. Look at all the fire. You can't see the red Look. from the inside. Like, you can only see the outer layer of fire. So just do, like, just change the outer layers of that top thing. The outer ring. Yeah, that looks good. I wish I could set the cobblestone permanently on fire. Yeah, that would be sick. But you don't want to have it all on fire. I feel like that would be too much almost. Yeah. <sighs> oh, I didn't have my armor on? <laughs> no wonder I was having hard, such a hard time getting beat up. <laughs> I was like, what the heck? My dang Brutal. Hold on, I just realized there are actually people in my chat and I haven't been looking at it. Oh, really? <laughs> One second. One Whoops. Second. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna give you my two viewers. Yo, <laughs> my two viewers. Oh, man. That's wild, man. Yo, I'm at 79 followers on Twitch. Yo. We're so close to 80. Yeah. Yeah, I follow so you on Twitch, right? I'm, I'm gonna double check real quick. Yeah, Hold you on. do. But, you know, hey, 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 anyone. It's always good to check. Yeah, like, why not? Play it safe. You know what Tommy Unit says. As in? Twitch sometimes has Twitch sometimes. What is it? It's just loco something. Loco the first. Loco. One st. The first. Yo, zombie villager. Uh... Bye. Ooh, spider. Yeah, I'm following already. Let's go. Yo, I got nad. <laughs> What? I got yo mad. money. <laughs> like yo I got money. Mad. Look at that three cents. Yum. Yo, yo money. Money. Mm, look at that three cents. Yum. Three cents. Let's go. You're playing, dude, you're playing with purple creepers. Yeah, dude, I have a texture pack. It's just my thing. Blazes are purple. Creepers are purple. Uh, charged creepers are purple, and red mushrooms are purple. Huh. And my GUI looks crap. It's like a rainbow GUI. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Dude, the fire tree looks good. Get this. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
dude, I am so close. Um, I am so close. Here, you know what? Let me let me just go into the thing. At everybody. No, not Evan. Not oh. At Evan's <laughs> echo. Just gonna no, see. you do add everybody, it's fine. Yeah, add everyone. Nope. What, what server is this in? Uh, the... No. Get out of here. That's not what I want. Delete. Delete. There we go. Uh, this is in the uh, cat server. At everyone. Okay. Anyone who purple zebras? What? Um, dang, this quartz looks really good. I am doing well with this. <laughs> They're gonna hate me for that. <laughs> They're gonna be like, stop adding everybody! I don't do it very <laughs> often, but it's fun. Yep. Fire tree. Tree of fire. Dude, somebody broke the back door to the church. Like, there's just a hole. Yo, what? To the tiny little castle church thing. No, not, not the castle. But that explains why there was no villager in there. Hmm. He got out. Nope. Some age. Purple zebras. Uh, where are you yeah, at? Dude, where are you seeing crazy. purple zebras? No. What? I... <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "What Minecraft mob are you looking uh, at?" That is a purple. No, no, zebra. no, no. Um, one of my friends, one of my friends who texted me said, "I dare you to say purple zebras with no context," and I oh. said it. <laughs> and then oh, I said it. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> yeah, it was really funny. I, I, I'll be honest, I said it the first time, and you sounded confused, and then we just moved on. I can't tell you how hard I was trying not to laugh. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> just, just scream. Dude, just wait until, like, just... you get more people that are interactive in the chat, and, like, they donate for you to, like, do things like delete your world or, like, say something weird in chat and, like... Oh, I'm gonna... Once, once I get uh, 100 followers, I'm gonna add some, like, things just to make... Just to make stream more interesting, so they'll be able to like donate for me to say certain things. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna have a. Hopefully, I can get the bits thing up and working. Where. Um, oh, they can just donate bits and like do things happen. They can donate bits and like sounds ha like make sounds and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be sick. I'm so excited. Dude, I'd love to. Do I'd love to. <laughs> make like a server or like a world, like a series, you know. Where like yeah. they control what goes on with the money, so like, oh. <laughs> so for like five dollars yeah. they can spawn yeah, yeah. like a zombie on me or something like that, and then like for like five hundred dollars they can like delete the world, <laughs> or like Ooh, or like kill brutal. me or like or like a hundred like oh. for like for like forty dollars they can kill me, you know? Because people people that like, have money do that all the time. They like, go into Twitch and they'll just right. look around for things. And they'll be like, oh, there's somebody on, like, right here. Like, they'll be like, for a hundred dollars, you can send me straight into the end. Yeah. <laughs> and people will yeah. do it. Like, people will come on just to do that. Oh, absolutely. It's so great. Hey, yo, you gotta... Here, toss him. Toss him. What? Toss him to me. The green man. Oh, the shoes? <laughs> no, no, no. Your, your little friend. Oh, this guy. Oh, here. Yeah. Watch me go die with him. <laughs> I don't mind. I don't plan on dying anytime soon. Here, here, here. You can have him back. Oh. Enjoy <laughs> your little friend. Goosey. Oh He'll wait, take this guy left too. You, you need him back, obviously. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just like, just like. What were you hey, saying? Hey, I have four viewers. One of them is probably Goosey. Like, what were you saying, Evan? Huh? She like. Were you saying freaks. something? She like freaks out in the chat. <laughs> I can't see chat. I don't know what's going on. It's like, what? Yeah. <laughs> were, were you saying something, Evan? <laughs> you just have two on your feet, one on your head, and two in each hand. Quadruple wielding. I can scroll, and there's still, like... Mm -hmm. 
you do you want some netherite while we're at it <laughs> no <laughs> nah That's a nah I'm a, I'm a grind host. like this like I said before like this yeah. is more of like an event server now oh yeah yeah, yeah. this is gonna be able to, like the cat server that I play on will be like my long term server yeah so. yeah hey that's the team eclipse server now homie we yep. are team eclipse yup we gotta the show eclipse who's SMP. boss are we gonna call it that team for eclipse. the rest yeah, of the time it is. cause like you know like obviously is. the hermitcraft server is called the hermitcraft server no matter what season right. they're on mm-hmm. and like the dream SMP is called the dream SMP I think SMP. that's the plan I think that's the plan and then we can market that really well like you said get jerseys for that for us yeah I think that'd be sick so, although I'm afraid that like the viewers are gonna come up with a name for it too, mm. you know, no, like like the no, dream team, like the, like the like choice. dream definitely did not come up with the name the dream team, like it just it oh, just absolutely happened. not. But so I wonder like what make, names they'll we come decide up with. for ourselves. Just saying, that's our server, our rules. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make this like an actual house though. You gotta make like a back window back here. I'm going to. Oh, to. you I'm know what you can like do? Basic, um, you know, what? For, you know what, here, frick it. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not? So like, no, no, no. So do, um. Oh yeah, you have access to server console, huh? Yeah. So for this, <laughs> like for this section, this main, this main hall, or maybe just this hall actually, mm-hmm. maybe just this square. Yeah. Make this like twice the height as the rest of the house. I think that's what I'm gonna make a second story, but I agree. And then this section stays lower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what you're saying. Cause then you could do. Um, I need. Hold on. You could do this. Um, like, uh, and I'll put all these back. Oops. But you could do. So let's say, how tall is Probably this? Probably gonna want to go four, four five. Right. One, two, On part, three, so four, two five. Oh, there you go. Like, let's say you did like this, and like. Oh yeah! 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 No, we'd want to do it one block out with the glass. Well, one block out on this side. Oh, like out from out from the wall. Yeah, yeah, here. I see what you're saying, though. Give it like a futuristic feel with the. How far are you gonna go with it? I think I'm gonna go most of the way. It's gonna wrap around the front. Yeah, like are you gonna go? I think it would be like here. Although we kind of picked a bad spot for it. Like it's gonna go like right over your handrail. Right. No. So here's. That. I think that's a good idea. It'll look. It'll give it like a cool little texture. Hold on. Why don't you do? Right here. No, I think you're onto something. Oh, I like that even better. Heck yeah. There we go. Wedge of the building. See, that's the whole shtick with me. Is like, I'm good as a builder when I have unlimited resources, but I always play in survival, so I'm a terrible builder. <laughs> right. got natural lighting and you can watch the sunset and rise only want to make this part like super high for this part like this square right we 
we could have like a little outside patio out here. MJ says commit arson. She wants me to commit arson? MJ, if you... How about this? MJ, I will commit arson if you gift a sub. Right Yo! Now. <laughs> sell out. <laughs> I am a sell out. Yeah, exactly. Maybe. Yo, yeah. yo, MJ, my tree hey, is gonna be made of arson. It's true. I'll go commit arson. I'll go catch a forest on fire. How about that? I'll just leave a little bit of it. You know, I'll like... I'll catch a little bit of it on fire. But I will, I will commit arson if you give a sub. I'm a sellout and I love myself for it. <laughs> and then, let's see. Because you're going to want some lighting, but you want lighting that works with light. Or white. So you'll probably want... Uh, what is it? Hold on. What was it? I was thinking about it. I mean, uh, sea One, lanterns. Two, sea three, lanterns. Three, four, five, it gives six. it like a bit of a futuristic feel. Sea lanterns. See, lanterns give things a bit of a futuristic feel. One, two, three. Yeah! Two, three. Oh, wait, is this... Hold on, how many? One, two, one, two. Uh, I would do end rods, but those are technically illegal. Plus, end rods don't actually get off that much light. No, they don't. They're just a cool little extra feature. Oops, I did that wrong. Let's see. Yo, Tyler, join the game. Yo. Yeah. Evan's house. Huh, Yo, see. it's Tyler. He was the judge. The, the, the judge. Hello, Mr. Judge. Hello. Judge. Hello. Ah, oh, bread. Here, for your offering of bread, I'll give you something. Wait, come back. I have a Oops. Oh my gosh, give him some inflation, why don't you? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hey, I did. I only did a half a stack. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's never going to need that much. Never. He'll never hey, you never know much. how much armor a man needs. <laughs> you never know how much armor a man needs. I know he doesn't need that much. <laughs> Day peasant. I'm just going to run out. He looked sl like very concerned with that. Oh, that's funny. That's so funny.
No, I will say I thought of starting a band once. Oh really? Yep. I had no one to start it with. <laughs> but I thought it would be cool. Neither did I, and then I learned music, and then my friend learned music, and then we had a band for like a day. <laughs> Yo, you guys had a band? Yeah. Crazy. Yep. What did you do? Okay. That's about a good height for that. Yeah. No, I, I wanted to. I wanted a band. I wanted to be part of a boy band. Oh yeah. I was like, I'll be, I'll be the next Boys to Men or Backstreet Boys or In Sync. But then I was like, I'm too chubby for that. <laughs> <laughs> I will, I, I, am not a, a face of the camera will love. <laughs> oh man. I'm saying that out of irony because we just talked about how much we, how much you're supposed to love yourself with mental health. <laughs> Yo, this looks sick. Yo, with the stairs like this, it actually looks really cool. Yeah, and then you can do like. Oh, we have to do uh. We have to do one of these things. Where you do like a. A little railing. <laughs> He's back. <laughs> Dual wielding diamond hose. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> of course he is. Of course. Legend. Um. Oh wait, yeah, and we can use freaking glass for a railing. I was thinking of like a railing, but I couldn't think of anything. Mm -hmm. Well, no, I want like a a second floor here. Oh, you do? Yeah. Partially at least. I've got that trick. Because I was thinking lock, but yeah, let's do second floor. Dippity hoppity, drip drip on my property. Okay, there's a couple ways we could do the fancy house staircase. Do you want to just do, um, here, how about this? No, man. No, hold on, hold on. Do no, 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 Yeah, 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 like watch, 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 watch. I, I, made, I made something awesome earlier. I know exactly what you might like. Oh, okay. Hold on. Here we go. I need to do it, like, the right way, though. Otherwise, it's going to, like... No, place, place the right way. is a good number. Oh wait, I did that one one block too low. Hold on. I liked it better the other way, I'll be honest. Yeah? Yeah. Like you don't like a grand staircase going straight up? Mm -mm, no. Okay. Actually, wait. Yeah, I don't like it. Okay. <laughs> I'm kidding, I totally messed with you the first thing. Like, wait. <laughs> I'm just indecisive as well, so that doesn't help my cause. Sometimes, most times when I say, oh wait, actually, I'm actually contemplating it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But not today. You're good. You're good. Alright, cool. We're gonna do bedroom up here. This is like the type of house like Robert Downey Jr. or David Dobrik would have. Yup. I'm gonna make like a we need I need to make like a state of the art gaming room in here, obviously. Um we'll need these. And then we'll need to do Oh you know what? I'll do this instead. This will be even better. No, 
Oh, shoot, I forgot to charge my phone. <laughs> okay, I'm ending the stream. <laughs>